Hey, what's going on everybody? Wacko Backo here. Real quick, I'm just going to do a short video. I still have another one dropping a little bit later on today, but I just want to do a recap of my first month on YouTube, uh, how amazing it's been, look at some of the numbers, and then kind of preview some of the stuff that's going to be opened up uh, in future content. And then I also got something to show you in this box. So <laughs> let's get started. So I got all my numbers written down here and uh, I apologize for my handwriting. It's absolutely atrocious, but I'm going to read all this stuff off. So um, my first month on YouTube started, uh, March 2nd. So again, today is that exact one month. Uh, within that time frame, I got 62 total subs, 641 total views, which is amazing. Watch time is almost 35 total hours, which is nuts. And then these are just the top 10 videos. So obviously my very first opening, uh, for people that have subbed to my channel, you know, as soon as you go to my channel, that's the first video that plays. So that makes sense. Uh, you guys love sword and shield tins. <laughs> you guys like tins in general. Um, the Pokemon collection boxes, you guys really, really like that one. So I'll have to do more of those. Uh, Pokey collect stuff, you guys really liked when I went through that stuff. So I'll definitely have to do more uh, through that. Uh, the Galar collection boxes, again, anything that's sword and shield that's coming out with the collection boxes, I'll be on top of it. Uh, Hidden Fate stuff. You guys really, really like the Hidden Fate stuff. And as you can see, I have more of that coming up. So stay tuned for that. Uh, and then again, more stuff from Poke Collect. So <clears throat> um, all I really want to say is I appreciate all the support. It's been a crazy first month. And I only continue to grow from here and keep putting out great content for you guys. So as you can see here, I got a bunch of Sword and Shield stuff to open up. Uh, I got a bunch of Hidden Fate stuff lined up for you guys. Um, but for right now, I'm just going to open up these five here, show you what's in this box, and then get you on your way. And then, like I said, later on today, I'll be dropping the actual video for today. So, let's get started. It's been, uh, like I said, it's been crazy. Um, especially, you know, about um, maybe a week, if that. I've had the Instagram up, and I'm looking at almost 400 followers on there. Um, just met a lot of really cool people and you know, like you, you realize how small this community really is so um, For all the guys out on Instagram. I appreciate it. Uh, hopefully you guys are watching this as well um, And like I said just continue to keep supporting the channel um, It's only gonna get better from here and obviously as I get more comfortable doing this and I find what or I figure out what you guys like to see um, the videos and the content are just gonna keep getting better and better so uh, I can't thank you guys enough. Code card there. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, later on this week, I will be starting to dip into all those uh, code cards that I'm sitting on. So you guys will have a chance to start collecting a whole bunch of those. So if you like code cards, definitely stay tuned for that. Let's look into these cards here. Sorry, my voice sounds a little weird. Grookey, Sobble, Rhyhorn. Brasilia, Reverse Gold Dean, and behind that is a Snorlax non hollow. All right, on to the next. Um, but yeah, I've got, I've kind of mapped out what videos I want to do this month so far uh, with the, the stuff that I have content wise. Um, still going to do some more collection series or collection showcase stuff. Hopefully, you guys. Or look, looking forward to that and enjoying that so far. I'm definitely doing some more Pokey Collect. Um, those custom booster packs that I had that had the Pokemon's faces on it. I got more of those coming in. So definitely got a lot going on here. So stay tuned. If you haven't subscribed yet, um, I highly recommend it. There we go. Frost Moth Holographic. Um, but yeah, there's. This, I would definitely recommend... Checking out the channel, looking at all the other playlists and stuff I have set up. Um, I'm trying to do the best that I can to make it look as professional and appealing for you guys as possible. Uh, and I've done a lot of research and invested time and money into this so far. So um, <laughs> if there's something else you guys want to see different or you have suggestions on how I could better myself, let me know. Um, all that stuff's very important and it's going to make the content better for you guys in the long run. So... Let me know in the comment section below. All right, let's see. Wooloo Reverse and behind that, Rapidash. All right, got two more. I'll show you what's in the box 
and then I'll get you guys out of here again. This is going to be a much shorter video for today. And then the regularly scheduled video is still going to be coming sometime this afternoon. Four to the front and the flip. All right. Just burning through these real quick. Clavopos, Wulu, Sobble, Blip Bug, and behind that, Poltegeist. All right. Last pack here. For now, obviously, I saw plenty more to open uh, eventually, but I'm trying to just map it out so I have enough content for you guys, and especially with how things are and things are going in the world right now, it's not super easy to, to keep going out and picking stuff up, especially because they keep putting more and more restraints on stuff, but I'll continue to keep providing content the best that I can. Um, yeah, and we'll just keep pushing forward. I like a good obstacle here and there. All right, Nurse Joy Reverse, and behind that, another Rapidash. All right, so nothing crazy in those packs, but uh, I'll show you the one poll that we had here. Got that Frost Moth Holographic. All right, so in here, this is what I'm going to send out to PSA to get graded. Uh, I'm going to wait a little bit because uh, PSA has been backed up pretty heavy because uh, everyone just has nothing free time now. So uh, they're just sending in all their stuff to PSA to get graded. But when I eventually do send it out, uh, I will show this video again, or I'll show the cards off again, rather. Uh, and then when they come back, uh, I'll let you guys know. So with the amount of cards that I have, I'm sending out 10 cards. Um, yeah, it will take about 30 days for them to come back when, when everything goes back to normal. If I was to send it out now, um, it would take way too long for them to come back. So <clears throat> what I'll do is I'll just showcase these real quick. Um, yeah, they're already in these prepackaged stuff. And just to save time, uh, maybe I'll post some pictures on Instagram so you can see each individual card that I'm going to send out. But I'll try and make this look the best I can. So good old Dragonite GX. Uh, Dragonite's one of my favorites. And I mean, it, what if I get high scores, that's great. I just want to get them graded and put in that, you know, that protective seal. And then I can display them up that way. But a lot of these are just some of my favorite cards um, that I've collected over the time. All right, so we got that Dragonite EX. That one dot right there is just on the sleeve. There's some kind of uh, fuzz or something on there. But yeah, absolutely amazing Dragonite EX. This is the full art from Evolutions. Um, this is actually my second one. The first one that I got was crazy miscut, so that one's in the binder. <coughs> Shining Mew from Shining Legends. Um, I have a whole bunch of these, so I thought I might as well send it out. Get graded. Shining Rayquaza. Again, I have a whole bunch of these, so at least send one out to get graded. Shining Arceus, if you guys have seen my binder preview, uh, I've got a bunch of these as well. So Mewtwo GX. So in the video where I showed the binder, I said I had a fourth one. Uh, this is the fourth one. This is probably the better, better looking one. Uh, the other ones have like a weird uh, spec or defect on it um, or just miscut. So it's your boy Guzma. Um, again, just, it's one of the better ones that I have, and I have like three or four of these, so I thought I might as well send it out to get graded. All right, now here comes the hitters. You ready? I don't know if you guys are ready for this one. So this is the Charizard Holographic from Team Up. This is like the, uh, the pre-release box that came out. Um, actually the only Team Up pre-release box I opened, and I got this one, so I thought I'd just put it, or, um, you know, package it up right away, um, I don't really know the value of any of this stuff right now. I haven't researched it. I just know that people like Charizards, and if you can get one graded pretty well, uh, it's always good to see there. <clears throat> All right, so two more. This one here, this is from Evolutions. This isn't base set. I don't want to get anyone too excited, even though I'm excited. But yeah, um, I pulled like two or three of these now. But again, this one looked like it was in the better shape. Um, and again, Charizards do really, really well. So hopefully we get a decent grade on it. And of course, the gem and the reason for why I even got back into collecting is this guy right here. Good old Charizard GX, the shiny version from Hidden Fates. Um, absolutely beautiful card. Um, and again, I know it's not, I don't think it's going to be a 10, but I'll take what I can get, especially non-graded. This card sitting at like 200 bucks right now, so... Uh, that's going to be it for today, guys. Well, at least for this video. 
Again, I do have another video coming up uh, a little bit later on in the day. I won't make you guys wait too long. Um, but again, this is all the other content and stuff that's coming up throughout the weeks. And uh, just stay tuned, guys. I appreciate all the support. And again, if you haven't subscribed yet, um, definitely look into it. Uh, look through all my other videos and content that I have. But yeah, stay tuned, guys. It's going to be another awesome month. I'm Wacko Backo. Take it easy.